Alrighty, hello there fellows and welcome back to Cube World with Tengu's RC. This time we're going to start out in Gigar City and head for that dungeon right over there using our brand new sword. That's actually looking pretty great right now. So yeah, let's get to it. Northwest is the direction we want to be going. And we've got George our pig, we've got a boat, and a hang glider, um, and we don't need to worry about those right now, we'll probably sell them eventually, but let's do this thing. Alright, trade district, crafting district, do 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 Looks like there's a cave in that mountain. I think we went through that cave last episode, but this episode we're going to do it again with our new and improved sword. So we'll get to check out how well it does against any of the enemies that are in there. Let's see if there are any bats. Bats? Bats? Okay, scratch that. We're gonna just keep on going. Ooh. Looks like there's a fight going on over here. And that person just got owned. We're not gonna go near those beetles. They look dangerous. Walking past, walking past. Alrighty. So, let's do this. This week, just to let you guys know, I think there are going to be two episodes of Cube World, because I missed out last week. Unfortunately, my schedule prevented me from uh, recording for a lot of last week, but this week I think we'll put out two episodes, and we'll see what comes our way world of Cube World. The world of Cube World. Although, right now, I'm gonna say I'm really liking this sword. Yep, yep, I am definitely liking this sword. Next cow. Alright, crows. Crows. Come here, you crows. Crows. Can't you just, like, gather up or something? Come on. Come on. All of you. All of you. Thank you. Ooh. And there we go. A vanilla cupcake and a wood staff. And we're level four. Let's open up our skill tree. Oh, level four. I really want to be able to go hang gliding. So we're going to upgrade this until we can get into the hang gliding. And then after that, we'll see what we can do. Because hang gliding in this game is honestly amazing. So, yep, we're definitely going to do that. Um, let's check the map real quick. Alright, we're getting there. Ooh. Are there any more around? Any more no bolts? Is there a bed I can sleep in? Anything? No. Alright. Um, I thought I saw a sheep. Ooh, a cave. I have to go in the cave. Whenever you see a cave, always go in the cave. Because... Typically there's iron and good stuff like that, 
Um, very useful for warriors who make all their stuff out of iron. Hey, it's a floating island. I haven't seen those much at all. That's cool. Um, glow shrooms. Glow shrooms are fun too. Alright, that's a raccoon. Okay. Um, actually, I think I could deal with the raccoon. Um, Give me a sec. I'm gonna come out here in the open where he can. Come on. <sighs> okay. That was good. That was actually really good. There's another raccoon right over there. They give me 10 experience, which is a lot. I think it's worth it. Let's do this. Ouch. Ouch. Um, that hurts. That hurts quite a bit. Alrighty, we'll keep on going, but if we encounter enemies like that again, we're gonna have to uh, use a potion, probably. And we're probably gonna have to come back to these mountains, because that's another cave, but it's guarded by an ogre, and I'm not powerful enough right now to fight an ogre, but they are a lot of fun to fight if you can do it. Are you, uh... <laughs> Thank you. I won't forget to take some potions with me when I go into a dungeon. Um, are these lemon beetles? I think we can take on the lemon beetles. Oh yeah, I'm at low health. Maybe we shouldn't have attacked the lemon beetles. Ah, we'll be fine. Right? Alright. Alright, come on. Ooh. Yes. Awesome sword. For the win. This is an awesome sword. I love how in Cube World you can customize your sword. That makes it just all the more personal. I don't know. That means a lot. Alrighty, where are we? We're almost there. Looks like it's a castle. That's good. Um, is there a sleeping bag? Nope. If there's a sleeping bag, then I can sleep in it and recover my health. Ooh. Okay, that looks intimidating. Let's see if we can find the entrance. That's the entrance right there. Pretty sure. Trick or no. Just take a quick peek. We don't want to go by the insect guards. Flies we can handle. Flies we can completely and totally handle. See? We got those flies. The insect guard, those guys are dangerous. But let's check this dungeon out. is it? Alright, Arulan Castle, and it's blue. Let's let's check the enemies out. Take a quick peek inside. Oh, it's orcs. That could be bad. from it. Candle! Great. And a lot of loot. Bombs, cotton yarn, water flask, candle. 
Oh, man. The only problem is those ogres. Those guys are going to be tough to fight. I knew we'd find some in here. But I think that's going to have to be it for this episode. Um, I'll probably be posting two episodes this week. Maybe we'll go in the dungeon right there for the second one. But it looks like it's a really big dungeon, so we might not get through it all in one episode. But this has been a lot of fun. We got here, we tested out our sword, it's great, and yeah, I think we're going to call it for this episode. Not going to go by the insect guards. Um, so yeah, our sword is great, we can kill raccoons, which couldn't do that before. Alrighty, so that's probably going to have to be it for now. Between episodes, I'm going to search for a place for me to rest up and cook some food. But yeah, I think that that's going to be it. Thank you fellows so much for watching. I really hope you've enjoyed. Tigron the Dwarf says bye with his giant sword in hand. That's like three times as tall as he is. Wow. All right. Thank you, fellows, so much for watching. I really hope you've enjoyed. And until next time, so long. <laughs>